Welcome to the race fields, motherfucker. This is Ayamori, the orchid assassin that blends ruthless precision with beauty and elegance. Lord have mercy, I'm about to bust. To understand Aya, we must first understand her heritage. Ayamori, a lone wolf among warrior who became a skilled for hire hitman at a young age navigating the shadowy realms where samurai traditions met the modern world's ruthlessness. Once, the Mori clan was celebrated across the empire their name synonymous with bravery and loyalty. But times had changed. The current emperor, Hiroshi, had distanced himself from old traditions, favoring new alliances and innovations that left many ancient clans, including the Morris, in obscurity. Aya is one of the few dozen descendants of her storied lineage. She's a striking figure. Tall, slender yet curvy, with a commanding presence, she wore her dark ruby hair down, her eyes, a deep and contemplative red, carried the weight of her ancestor's unfulfilled legacy. Clad in a dark kimono adorned with a discreet dragonfly emblem signifying her affiliation with the covert dragonfly gang. T. Dragonflies, a secretive underground organization known for their network of spies and assassins. The dragonflies operated in the dark corners of the empire, their influence seeping into politics, commerce, and the criminal underworld. They were a fitting choice for Aya, offering not only the tools and contacts she needed but also the anonymity to execute her missions with precision. Aya's entry into the dragonflies was marked by her ability to blend traditional samurai skills with modern tactics. She undertook missions with a ruthless efficiency that belied her noble heritage. Her primary objective was to infiltrate the highest echelons of the Emperor's court and expose the corruption and dishonor that had contributed to her clan's fall from grace. In the shadows of this turbulent era, Aya's name began to resurface, whispered with both fear and respect. She had become a phantom in the court's nightmares, a symbol of the old ways demanding recognition in a world that had seemingly forgotten them. Her story was just beginning. What's poppin', Spooky Gang? And welcome back! Or welcome to the channel for your first time. In today's video, you already know I got some more gang back! All right, I got some more urban heat gameplay for all of you spooky FPS lovers out there. Uh, they just came out with an update. Uh, we finna, we finna see what they whole do. The loading up the game uh, on the home screen right now, you can kind of see nothing has really changed. If you guys haven't played in a while, um, they did add some different visuals, some artwork. Um, so I, I'm not gonna lie, it does look really nice. It's looking a lot crispier. Um, but the real difference is supposed to be in the gameplay. So without further ado, let's see what that mount do. All right, so graphics still kind of look the same. Ooh, my movement lines. Oh, that grenade toss was nice. Hold up, hold that for me. My aim might be on point. Hold up, let me stick somebody. Hey. Yo, the bots still, they still going crazy though. Hold up, let me hit them with this nasty ass flank. Supposedly they made them more human-like, uh, just with like real based on decisions. Um, they definitely still got aimbot, they got grenade hacks, uh, they got it all, they juiced. Mmm, that aim is sticky. And yes, I am playing on aim assist. You are a fool if you are not playing on aim assist for an aim assist game. I'm just saying. Do not complain about no goddamn aim assist, brother. 
I've never lost this. Hold up. I've never lost. <clears throat> As I was saying, this game feels pretty nice though. Um... <laughs> Yo, who is shooting me? That is crazy. Mm, that headshot was smexy. Yo, hold up, teammate. You getting pieced up, baby. Moving to cover. Hit him with my flank one more time. Definitely hopping around. They're gonna be right around. Yeah, I knew they were gonna be right around this corner. Oh shit, I'm dead here. You good, brother? Hello? I don't know uh, how much more human they actually need these bots. Oh, I'm dead here. That is crazy. The wall hacks. I'm just saying, we're gonna blame it on the wall hacks. Hold that. Mm, gotta hit marker. Come here. Oh shit! Papa Bowl is kind of moving. I'll see you. Yeah, you should never do this. I should have swapped to my pistol. I see a person over here though. Let me take the one. My aim. Oh my god. No aim assist is gonna save me there. I love the movement with this pistol though. I love the movement there. Uh, let me know if you guys have played um this chick right here. Oh shit, hold that. Um, let me know if you've played her because she's a light. Um, I know she has that big ass sniper and stuff, but does she move a little bit more fluent? Cause she's considered a light infantry. Um, that'd be kind of interesting to know. Maybe I should play her sometime, but uh, I'm going to have one more gameplay for you guys. I'm not going to commentate for it. Um, I hope you guys uh, did enjoy this video. If you did, be sure to slap that like button. Like I'd be slapping these bots in this game. Uh, consider subscribing if y'all are new around here. Uh, and I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace.
On the bus, go. 